This morning, families in Dauphin County continue to clean up after an EF1 tornado blew through several communities last week. The Fox 43 Sedona Meadows joins us now live from Bellevue Park in Harrisburg, a neighborhood that was heavily affected by the storm. Sedona, it sounds like you had some chainsaws going on out there behind you. Yeah, Sean, they're already getting busy this morning, trying to clean up some of the, the uprooted trees that are still in people's yards. I'm going to show you a little bit of this view right now. Obviously, people are getting busy, getting getting to work on this front yard right here. Um, but there's just a lot to see in this neighborhood. Obviously, a lot of uh, devastation as far as uh, trees down. I know I'm told that some of these trees are, you know, well over 100 years old, and now they are just lifeless, which is really, really sad to see. Um, and according to the city of Harrisburg, uh, the Public Works Department uh, will be here in this neighborhood as well as some surrounding areas working 12 to 16 hour days working to really clean things up here and they're going to continue that cleanup effort throughout this week. Now thankfully no one was hurt from the tornado but the cost of this damage is high. Right now the city of Harrisburg estimates after a preliminary estimation around $150,000 for debris removal, around $100,000 for road repairs and around $167,000 in utility damages including street lights. Now this doesn't include the buildings that were affected by the storms. The city says 111 properties have sustained damage in the Harrisburg area. A tornado ripped right through a heavily populated neighborhood in the city and somehow no one was hurt. It's amazing but it left a lot of damage in its wake. These trees were eight foot in diameter, um, unbelievably sized oak trees that were you know just uprooted and thrown like pencils quite honestly. Now, right now, the city says they're working on calculating the damages seen in Dauphin County, not including homeowner damage, to see if the overall cost reaches the threshold to declare it an emergency in order to receive federal funding. The city also encourages that if you have debris around your home that needs to be picked up, leave it on the curb, no questions asked. Or if you need some assistance with getting some of that debris outside of your, your, your front lawn, um, you're encouraged to email the Public Works Department. We have more information on our website at fox43.com on what that email is, but give them written permission to come onto your property and help you remove that debris. But for now, live in Harrisburg, Sedona Meadows, Fox 43 News. And like you said, Sedona, I mean, just that massive tree trunk that you can see behind you, the cleanup there, yeah. it's definitely going to take a couple more days. So thanks so much for that report. Yeah.